facebook post or the social media post in this tutorial so if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications at first i'll go into the file and taking new options from here i'll take the artboard 2000 pixel and 2000 pixel and here i'll make the social media post smp and hit the create button you'll get the blank layer over there and then going to the file and going to the place embedded options from here i downloaded the paper texture and i'll just place over there okay that's nice and then restylize this one because of um, if you do restylize you can make the smart object again before uh, if you want to edit in future you can just uh, work with that so convert to a smart object okay that's good and now then going to the place embedded options and here is the png brush i'll import this brush so this brush is like that okay that's fine right press and resellize the layer and i'll go to the filter and camera filter so from here i'll make this one black and white hue and saturation i'll make it down and hit ok so after that i'll make this one blend into the multiply okay that's good and again press ctrl or command j so two times press ctrl or command t and i'll make this one a little bit of bigger so that's good so bigger one i'll keep this one into the downside so turning off this one and the upper one this one i'll go to the file now and go to the place embedded because of i want to take my model image now so select this after importing this one right press and restylize the layer and here is the selection uh, which is a subject selection so select all the image one at a time so photo will select over there and press ctrl or command j before that select and mask go to the select and mask and make this one a little bit of a smooth edge shifting a little bit of like this and make the new layer with the layer mask or you can make the new layer and hit ok so this one is the new layer only and delete the background one and press ctrl command t for the transform and make this one a little bit of smaller and a little bit of upper side so one thing is that i want to cut the uh, downside uh, according to this brush so press the command and hold it so this one will select so this one is the technique to uh, selection of the uh, brush so before that make this one into the layer mask and now control or command and select this one and going to the filter going to the select and inverse this one so now this one is the inverse and select this mask that means the girl's mask and going to the brush tool and normal brush that is the soft brush and brush the downside of the photo so easily you can mask this one so make sure that when this one is white you have to make this one into the black okay press ctrl or command d it will be deselect now i'll increase the uh, brightness and exposure so making this one and contrast as well and the saturation and hue as well and hit ok that's fine and now let's see here uh, some text and the city everything so now the bigger one is for the city or other else so making this one bigger like this okay that's fine and now going to the file again and going to the place embedded options from here i downloaded a city image like that and i'll make this one clipping mask create clipping mask and then i'll go to here going to the adjustment layer and make this one black and white so this one press ctrl command e that means merging this one or you can just only uh, create clipping mask okay that's fine so this one is the group for down brush db and the upper brush so ub so UB upper brush down brush so it will help you how to make uh, proper editation in future so I'll make this one little bit of down from here okay that's good 
if you want you can adjust the height and weight in everything of these okay that's fine and i'll make the fill color a little bit of like this so not too much little bit of things okay that's good now i'll import the uh, like uh, splatter brush that means the like noise brush noise and place over there right press and flip horizontal or you can flip like a vertical or 90 degree so and now flip vertical again yeah that's fine not too much little bit make this one feel down not too much little bit okay that's fine and now right press and restylize actually restylize the layer and take the blank layer over there and going to the brush and uh, like a splatter blush brush which is uh, you know, for you can import from there import brush going to the import brush i have some brush collection i downloaded the brush from here i'm getting the splat uh, splatter or splash splash over there so right press and okay gradient splatter so here some splatter you can get over there so splat like that or little bit so you can do yeah this type of splatter but you have to make the color like this type of color not too much so like subtle subtle one so you can use the other one little bit okay that's good not too much okay now i'll go to the UV that means the upper brush and making this one a little bit of bigger and the lower brush or down brush I'll make it a little bit of smaller okay that's good okay and hit the tick button and now in upper brush I'll get another new layer and go into the brush again and the soft brush choosing here the yellowish or like orange brush and just make this one create clipping mask and make this one into the soft light or overlay for making this one pop up so you can make this one like a mask and masking this one because of i want to keep this one only in a face not in a hair so brushing this one g from the gradient or g for the gradient and i'm just deleting those things from here okay only in eyes okay that's good so you're getting these type of things and now and upper side i'll take the solid color of the background and that would be like that and the fill should be like that because of i want to show that paper text ash color at a time so upper brush lower brush and this one is the bg giving the bg now time to add some text so here is the text uh, party night so i'll take two text key from the text tool and night i'll write down okay i'll make this one into the white color that's good and i'll make the uh, font size smaller like 18 that's good and placing for that and the, another one is the cursive that is the party okay and choosing a font which is this one breathing and not all caps okay font size will be bigger that's good hit the tick button and then place this one into this portion okay in a night option this one i'll use the word going to the blending options and going to the drop shadow and using the drop shadow like this so drop shadow should be settings should be like that 808 or like 505 that's good and hit okay and you can copy this style copy the layer style and paste the uh, layer style over there so this one will be popped up so now this one is the text that means the title so i'm making this one group because of if i need to change anything 
from this design you can change and you can find it easily so press ctrl or command t and making this one a little bit of bigger that's good okay nice and these two that means uv and gb i'll make this one a little bit of middle of this okay i hope this one is the middle one and now title this text so here is the text entry uh, 30 plus that means 30 plus member could entry and uh, december uh, that is the december 2023 so december 2023 taking this text normal this one is the icon this one is the facebook icon or social media icon and uh, all the stuffs so this one is a text group and copying this one and controller command v pasting this point and you are getting all the stuffs over there making this one group and like text so here i use a font which is the poppins and i'll provide the font um, in my video description font name so in this portion i'm getting like uh, here is not vis visibility properly uh, because of this one is uh, overlapping over there so making this one mask g from the keyboard that means gradient and removing this part because of this part is vital okay that's good uh, because of uh, uh, here is the info okay that's fine here is another one and i'm copying this layer style you can take this layer mask and just apply over there it will apply properly in this portion so our design is ready you can make simply amazing and creative design like this by using my technique so hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for the new notifications until the next video stay safe stay healthy yes i'm signing out today bye bye